What's going on guys? Welcome back to another exciting episode of 970 Bass Fishing. I just got off work. Grab my rods, tackle, and we're gonna head out to Pirate Lake for the hour of sunshine I have left. Uh, start off real quick by saying I'm sorry for the gap in the footage, guys. I've been pretty sick lately with sinuses and everything like that. It's just been really bringing me down. But I'm back at it. We're going back out. I've actually tried a few times and there just hasn't been anything going on with the cold front and everything else coming in. It passed. It's been actually really warm today and it was warm yesterday. So I'm hoping that these bass have gotten back in the mood to move around again. And hopefully we can catch one out here today. I want to also let you guys know that I have a new vlogging camera, which is what you're seeing right now. It's the new addition to the family and to this channel. I think it's going to do a lot of good for this channel. And uh, it films amazing. I love it. I'm absolutely in love with the footage that I get out of it. But uh, it's, you know, it's super exciting for me, guys, because I actually get to share with you guys not only fishing and teaching you how to fish but also my creative side and share with you my love of filmmaking and videography so that's really exciting as well but yeah we're just gonna cruise on over to pirate lake it's not too far from my house so we'll actually get to fish it for a little while and uh i'll get at you guys when we get out to pirate peace all right, folks, we made it out to the lake. Sun's going down, as you can tell. We're walking out to the first spot. All the way back out here. I'm gonna start, uh, I'm gonna throw this jerk bait and a chatter bait. I'm gonna try to rip both of those through the grass over here in this cove. I think they're back here. This is my spot number one. We'll see, uh, we'll see if it works out, guys. I'm going to get you guys on the chesty, and uh, we'll get at it. We'll start fishing. Fishing for bass. What's up, That's folks? Welcome to the chesty. All this grass right here. This is what I'm fishing today. I'm going to throw this jerk bait for a little bit because I just love jerk bait fishing. It's either the jerk bait or the chatter bait that's going to be the key player today, folks. I came out here late at night, well, basically because I got off work late. I think it's going to be the best time. The best time to fish is uh, later in the evenings, especially with the water temp being so cold still. Today was a little warmer, well, a lot warmer. So hopefully it gave some of these bass the idea that they can come back up and hang out. If this doesn't work guys, yeah, like I said, the chatterbait or I might just go with the trick worm. A nice subtle presentation, give them something small, kind of feel these fish out and just see what they want. Because it's not really normal conditions yet, so... You kind of have an idea of what to fish with, but it's more so a little bit of junk fishing. Just because <laughs> you just don't know. You can throw everything that you think is going to work and they could want something completely different. Alright, let's try a new tactic. We don't have much time to fish. I won't waste much time fishing the same bait. Let's try the old chatter bait out. All right, let's move to the juice, as I used to call it.
to this entrance spot, spot A, aka Old Faithful. We're going to see if we can't find at least one bass before the sun goes down. Throwing the chatterbait around. All this grass here. Yes, yes, I got one, guys. Running at me, too, on the chatterbait. Yes, finally, found a fish. Yes. <laughs> he choked on that thing. That's a freaking little stud. All right. No blood. All right, guys, check out this freaking stud. It's probably not more than a pound. Maybe a pound and a half. I don't know. Caught him on the old chatterbait, just rolling it, ripping it through the grass pretty hard. This old chatterbait with the swim bait here. There we go. Yes, we found a fish. Let's get this girl safely back in the water here. <laughs> he took a bite, wanted to leave with my finger. Sweet. Sweet, sweet. No picture or anything, but oh well. There we go, that fish freaking choked on that thing. Yes, I'm so excited I caught a fish. So excited. After all this cold front and everything running through here, finally got myself a bass, guys. That fish was freaking fat. Like, really fat. Been munching out there. All right, folks, that's going to complete the day today out here at Pirate Lake. I'm going to go home and work on editing some footage, finally. And uh, let me know what you guys think of the new camera. It's pretty sweet. It's going to be good for the channel. It's going to be good. I'm telling you. But, yeah, uh, that's about it, guys. Caught that fish on the chatterbait. Uh, it had a Kitek swim bait on the back of it. I was just running it and ripping it through the weeds here. And finally that little stud came out and smoked it. He swallowed that thing all the way down. He wanted that. So that's a good sign. Hopefully if the weather stays like it is, it's going to pick back up again, which will be really nice because I am tired of all these storms and all the wind and everything like that. And I want to get out here and film. Get out here and catch some fish. Make some quality content for you guys. If you guys liked the video, smash that subscribe button, give me a like, leave me a comment down below, let me know what you want to see in the next videos. Let me know what you guys like, what you guys don't like, all that kind of stuff. But uh, yeah, I'm running out of daylight. I'm going to head out of here, but it's been fun. It's been great. I caught a fish. I caught a fish on the chatterbait. So, all right, guys, until next time, stay hooked. Get out there and catch some fish. Peace.